Welcome to Barry D's 80s Music Video of the Day. I'm your host, Barry D, bringing you one music video a day from the overplayed to the underplayed, from the terribly common to the terribly bizarre. I've got them all here, so please join my Facebook page and subscribe to my channel for lots more music, commentary, and trivia. And remember, the video is always at the end of the show. Now, if you have any memories or comments on today's music video or today's show, please be sure to leave them right below this video. So let's go to 1985 and 1986. This is a song by Phil Collins from his third solo album, No Jack or Required. Everybody was required to have this album. If you didn't, Death Chambers for you. Had to have it. The single was not released in the UK, even though it hit the top 10 in the US in September of 1985. Because the British are like, we don't have to follow you just because you're American. We don't like Genesis that much. We're not doing it. The B side of this was We Said Hello Goodbye, and that was released as a bonus track on the CD version for No Jacket Required. And in Australia, the single was released with the title, a little different, Billy, in parentheses, Don't Lose My Number. Now, Phil Collins has even stated that the lyrics to Don't Lose My Number were improvised and that he himself... Not really sure what they mean. Collins did not know what to use as a theme for the song's music video, and that's what makes this a classic. So he decided that it would show his decision process for selecting the theme for it. And in the video, Collins is talking to various directors, and they're all giving him these crazy ideas for the video, and their suggestions allow Collins. He parodies several other music videos at the time, and they're all really classic, good 80s videos, so you're going to want to go watch them afterwards. Uh, for example, he did uh, David Lee Ross, California Girls. He did Elton John's I'm Still Standing. Um, oh, The Cars, um, You Might Think, and The Police, Every Breath You Take, were ones that were in there. And he also... He also um, copies some movies like uh, Mad Max 2, some samurai movies, and also some some westerns are thrown in there. So his wife at the time, Jill, Ta Jill Tableman, she makes a cameo on the beach scene as the model who smiles at him. And this was wife number two of three for Phil. Now, as a side note, it's been said that Collins sent her a facts when he wanted a divorce now this has been denied several times but then wife three she later texted collins to do the same thing to him years later <laughs> that's gotta leave a mark huh let's go to the countdown u.s billboard hot 100 number four australia number 10 canada number 11 new zealand number 22 u.s billboard adult contemporary number 25 u.s Billboard Hot Mainstream Rock number 33, Dutch Singles Chart number 44, because UK wouldn't have any part of Phil Collins on this. So anyway, how do you watch this video today? You've heard it a million times. If it doesn't come up over here, you're watching it on a cell phone, it doesn't come up, or a iPad or a tablet of some sort, whatever, don't care. Not that hard to watch it anyway, because... I make sure there's a link in the Facebook page and also directly below this video. All you have to do is click right below where it says direct link to music video. Bam, you're in, you're watching it. But, Billy, there it is. I hope see you tomorrow.